Richards here with PTC Optics. Um, right now we are unboxing the 20X IP and I'm just going to show you all the connections, everything that has to do with this camera. Um, for more about the IP streaming, uh, we have a GUI video, which is a GUI. Uh, take a look at that. I'm not going to go into that piece of it. But here's the power supply. Here is the, um, that includes your, your cabling, the remote control. And then here is the camera. Pack these in pretty tight. All right, here we go. And check this out. By the way, I am using the PT Optics 20X USB to record this video. So it gives you a, a exact same lens, and uh, it will give you a very good idea of what the quality of this camera is going to look like. Put that out of the way. Here is the back of the unit. So let's zoom into the connections here uh, to give you a good close look at what we have. So starting from the, the this side over here, we have our IP streaming, which has a line in and out for the um, audio. And that audio line in will be embedded with your uh, IP streaming. So this camera can do dual streams, one high def and one standard def stream at the same time. That's uh, useful for streaming to mobile devices and also having uh, HD signal for you know, regular desktops. We have um, an HDMI signal here and an HD-SDI signal here. So all three of these inputs can si uh, stream simultaneously. Uh, then we have our USB 2.0, that is just for firmware updates. We have our RS-232 in and out, so you can daisy chain control. And then we have our regular analog input. This does not stream simultaneously with these three but it's there as an option uh, to accommodate just more flexibility. Now let's take a look at the remote control right next to the camera. Uh, just briefly show you the remote control here. As you can see, we have uh, presets that can be selected here. We have a, let's see if I can just focus just a hair here. Um, presets are all right there. Uh, setting and clearing a preset right here. This is the focus, that's the button I just used there to focus in on the remote. Zoom, and you can control up to four cameras. Now let's take a look at the on-screen display menu. As you can see here, we have uh, settings for exposure, um, so you can change uh, brightness, backlighting. Here's color, this is where we can do RG tuning, um, which I had already set to negative two, uh, four for that. Here's the saturation. You can see the saturation changing there. I kind of like it desaturated. Hue IR filter, um, which actually makes a big difference here with three different IR filters. Um, we have a couple different um, settings here. Here's for image, luminous, contrast, sharpness. This is where you can flip the image both horizontally and vertically as needed. You know, all, lots of different softwares interpret these cameras differently. So it's nice to have that feature built in. Um, this is how you can change the PTZ options. Here's the noise reduction for both 2D and 3D noise reduction. And then um, that's pretty much it. There's more controls available in the GUI. So this was the 20X IP. Thanks for watching, and feel free to send us any questions that you might have.